Hello, this is the Silver Watchman, and welcome back to Sea Shine. Now, I do realize I have not made an episode of Sea Shine since, uh. Oh, wow, since the death of my own grandmother. Uh, yes. We're off to a pretty high point, aren't we? Good gosh. Alright, so this episode is just basically to, um. Uh, to to really explain how to navigate my channel. Now, first of all, the title, the title of every single video will tell you what every single video is about. If the title says something along the lines of, uh, I don't know, hey, this is the this is some of the meaning of life. That means it's some of the meaning of life. Which means if you if you read the title of it, that tells you what I'm pretty much going to be talking about throughout the throughout most of the video. Now, because of the fact that I do have ADHD, I'm going to get a little distracted every now and then, and I'm going to deviate from you know the main topic because well I I can't help it. Um. Oh yes. Before every single video, I pray to God. I pray to God that he will speak through me his will. Okay? I pray to God that he shall speak through me every single... I want that star. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. You still can't catch me. Oh, gosh. Oh. Oh. Well then. Yeah. Success. Alright, uh Yes, because of the fact that I do have ADHD. ADHD is attention deficit hyperactive disorder. I have that. I also have a little bit of craziness, which means oh, oh no. Uh, oh. Well then. I believe I may have died in record time. But this is Sea Shine, it's an endless game, and I got rid of all the ads, so that means pretty much you get to. Yeah. Alright. <clears throat> so, like I was saying, before every single video, I pray to God that He shall speak through me His will. That whoever may, may come to be saved will be saved by His words. And how God does that is, is in one of three ways. Through the Holy Spirit, he shall speak through me. Taking over completely, but I, I was still, like, I'm still there kind of conscious. I'm still there, I'm still, like, speaking, and I'm, I'm aware of what God is saying. Now... For God to do that means that I am in, in kind of a, in a way, like great emotional turmoil, meaning I'm either really, really angry and agitated that I can't even form coherent sentences anymore, or I'm so like distraught with sorrow or pain emotionally or physically, physically happens too, you'd be surprised that I can't speak. So then God will just simply take over and speak using my voice through me to speak to you, the audience, and you, the human. And there are times where he has me address the demon that is possibly either right behind you or next to you. Because let's face it, they're there. Until you get them out of your household, they're always going to be there. But in future videos, I'll explain how to get rid of demons. But for now, just pray for protection. You're going to need it. Especially if you're going to be coming to serve God. So, yeah, I pray to God and then he speaks through me. That That's one of the ways. Another way that he will speak through me is kind of like... um. 
If you've ever done anything... Oh, gosh, this guy again. Oh, no. So, have you ever seen, um, like, you know, how anchors, like, anchor movies or, like, documentaries about doing an anchor show? Uh, that's kind of what it's like. Where God kind of uses, like, a heavenly teleprompter, putting the words in front of me to say... And I just repeat what God puts in the words that God will put in front of me. And the words that he'll put in front of me are words that I know. So sometimes it'll be words in other languages. Other times it'll be, oh, oh, good gosh. <clears throat> other times it'll be, um, you know, oh, geez. Uh, uh, it'll be like. Yes. It'll be like, you know, different stuff. It'll be like like the language that you hear right now, which is English, which is my primary language. I lost the ability to speak a lot of other languages after receiving some uh, head trauma a couple years back. Gosh, that guy's persistent. Yeah, so after receiving some head trauma, I lost the ability to speak a lot of other languages. Unfortunately. Now, up next, we're going to talk about the numbering system. But yeah, a little bit more on the, on how God, another way God will do it is that, um, that, 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 that's a, that's the main way that a God will speak his will through me. By putting the words in front of me for me to see, not with my human eyes, but with my soul. And so then I repeat what I see from what God is showing me. Now, because I'm a very monotoned being in my voice, you're not going to hear a lot of emotion unless you're able to see my face, and I don't want to show my face. Also, this is a numbering system. I use Roman numerals because a lot of the English numbering system is can be in a way related to old sigils that represent different things in demonic languages if you set them up properly but a lot of people don't know about that sometimes I wish I didn't know about that but glory be to God that I do that I don't accidentally mislead anyone because that is the last thing I want to do. Are you kidding me? I don't want to see the wrath of God again. That was terrifying enough the first time. I'd rather... I'd rather obey God... And see His grace and mercy... Than have to see His wrath. I'm not appointed to wrath... I don't have to worry about it, but other people are. If you're not saved, you're appointed to wrath. Meaning, when the tribulation begins, and it's going to happen, you are going to be in some serious agony. The wrath of God will be poured out on you. And I, as a silver watchman, don't want you to go through that at all it's awful it's terrifying when you see it from afar you're just like wow that is awesome when you're experiencing you're experiencing it it's just like oh my gosh that is oh my gosh it's it, i don't have enough time to describe how it feels just know that it's very very scary and that you'd rather be within the grace of God than to be, you know, outside of God's graces. So continuing on. So yeah, I use a Roman numeral numbering system. And that is also the way that I perceive... Oh, geez. That I perceive numbers... That I perceive numbers normally. That's just... That's also why... I, oh, gosh. That is also why I am, um, 
very, very bad with numbers. Because a lot of the numbering system is uh, like different things in different languages, and I just see numbers as... as how, how they are. So I'm not very good with numbers at all. Because of that, because I have to balance everything out and convert it to normal numbering, normal numbering into Roman numerals and I have to remember how to convert Roman numerals into your numbering system. So it gets, it gets kind of complicated. And I do have that chart there. It also helps me out to like see. Okay, so this is how this number would look in their language. Okay. Okay, that makes it a bit... It makes it easier on me. And me putting this in this video would also make it easier on you. Now you understand. Now, continuing on, as the as time goes on, I'm going to be doing this for 30 years. So if I don't touch a topic that, that you want me to talk about now, God will have me touch that topic probably later on. When either you or I am ready enough to speak on that topic. So if right now you don't like what I'm talking about... Oh, gosh. Oh, that food's not agreeing. Sorry. Um. Then, you know, just keep on holding on, okay? I'm doing this for God. Okay, I'm not doing this for you, the human. I'm doing this because I love God and God said, hey, do this for me. So if you don't like it, I mean, there are other channels, but... There are probably not many channels that truly serve God. And truly have a love for humanity and a love for God. I absolutely hate your sin. I hate your darkness. I've lived in that darkness and I hate the dark. But I love God and I love his light and I love his grace. And there are so many things that God does, and it's so awesome, and I want you people to see that. Just to see how awesome and how cool it is to serve God. Now, I keep, I look at, at things mostly from a darker perspective, because I came out of a darker area. And we'll touch more on that in the future. But know this. You can have a hard time finding somebody who does who does something for God and truly does have a love for him. And because of that love for God, we'll do this with a oh gosh. Oh no. I forgot he was there. Oh gosh. <clears throat> and we'll um you know we'll do this with with a with a love for you as well. I want you to be saved. And I want you to be safe. And the only play, the only way that I know that you will be safe is in the hands of God. Oh, you're weird looking. Oh, nope. Nope, you're danger. Everything here wants to kill me. That's nice. But I want you to come and serve God. I want you to love God. Like how I love God. And to serve God. You don't have to serve God the same way I serve God. Because the way I serve God is different than the way that you serve God. Alright? Just keep that in mind. Just make sure that you serve God in a way that actually honors God and is God-fearing. And a lot of Christians now, they don't talk about, you know, fearing God. And I do. I consider myself to be a man of God. A man does not walk that does not walk with religion. 
but a man who will walk with God himself. Because that is the only way to truly walk. So now you know how to navigate my channel. I know there's a lot of other things I said too, but for the most part, this is basically a video that explains how to navigate my channel. Also, in the description section of my channel, of like, uh, that, that uh, in the about section, that's where I like, basically say my whole mission and everything. It's been really well filled out. It took me days and months to fill that out because I, I was looking for the right words and I had to, at the end, ask God for help. It is truly an honor that I get to do this, though. Glory be to God. But I want you to know this. In the description of every video would tell you what um what company the 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 game belongs to and pretty much where where to get it. Or like at least where I got it. Now all my artwork I've done myself. And glory be to God for giving me that skill. Some people are more talented than me, but thank you for sitting through the whole video. Blessings be upon you. And glory be to God that somebody like you gets to sit here and listen to God too. Silver Watchman, Sonny.